This is an audiovisual representation of a study published in the Journal of Bone and Joint Surgery in 2020. First time anterior dislocation of the shoulder is relatively common and occurs in roughly 25 out of 100,000 people. While many patients are managed without surgery, some experience a recurrent instability of the shoulder, which can lead to long lasting complications. For high risk cases, such as young or male patients, it has been suggested that surgical stabilization of the shoulder through arthroscopic bank heart repair is preferred over arthroscopic washout. At the Royal Infirmary at Edinburgh, UK, a previously randomized double blinded trial comparing bank heart repair to washout demonstrated the clear advantages of bank heart repair over a two year period. However, because there was limited data on the long term benefits of bank heart repair over washout, a follow up study was conducted to compare them over a period of at least 10 years post operation. In this study, 88 patients aged 35 or less were enrolled in a single center double blinded clinical trial between 2001 and 2005, in which they were randomly assigned to undergo either bank heart repair or arthroscopic washout. After an average of 14.2 years postoperatively, they were contacted for reassessment and for data on recurrent instability, satisfaction, function, and the need for revision surgery. 65 of the 88 patients responded to the call for reassessment. The group that underwent bank heart repair had significantly lower rates of recurrent dislocation at 12%, compared to the group that underwent arthroscopic washout for whom the rate was 47%. Additionally, there was a lower need for revision surgery, and functional scores were also higher for patients who had undergone bank heart repair. Therefore, Arthroscopic bank heart repair as a treatment for first time anterior shoulder dislocation is efficient even over the long term.